Yes, sir! Okay, so we are doing something today that we don't usually do. We're going for big fish, big bites. We typically are going for for numbers of fish and, and the big lake is, is really good for doing that. We are on the big lake today, uh, just in a, in a different area. So where we are, it's restricted to protect the lake trout population. You're limited to one hook. Now that either being a single shank hook or a treble hook such as this one, but you're only allowed to have one. So I took this back hook off, so we're down to one. And I also have to pinch the barbs on this thing. So I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to take pliers, which are right here, some large pliers, so it's nice and easy to do. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hook points here, not hook points, the barb of the hook, and I'm going to break it off, because <laughs> that's good. <laughs> So to give him an even better fighting chance, I broke one off and I don't really want to put a new one on. So I'm going to pinch the rest of these. Because We're that good. We only need two hooks on a treble. Yeah. So you have to be barbless in this area. Uh, rules are set in place for protection of the lake trout. Also not allowed to target lake trout at all where we are. So this area known in the summertime um, personally for big walleyes, um, I, I like to come here if I'm looking for a bigger bite. And I've never really ice fished here. I just figured this would be a great place to, uh, to come and try to get a big one through the ice. So that's what we're doing. Um, not looking for numbers today, looking more for, for big fish. Uh, there are a lot of lake trout in the area. So if we do end up catching one of those on accident, what we're going to do is we're going to get it up the hole, unhook it as quickly and efficiently as possible turn it right back and send it. We're probably not even going to show the camera. Um, for legality purposes. Yeah, we're not going to show the camera like on purpose. Like we're not going to hold it up and take pictures and measure it and stuff. We're literally going to get it up to the point where we can take the hook out, turn it back around and shoot it back down the hole. And that's, that's the proper way to do it. Gosh, there's so many rules here. So there's one hook, debarbed. I even gave him more of a chance to rip the hook point off the other one. Um, no live baits. We've got these. Do we want to show them? Yeah, we've got these gulp minnows. Secret. These tiny little gulp minnow things. They're luma glow, glow, luma, luma glow. Just a tiny little, little thing. I'm going to tip on there as if I were to do like a real minnow head or something like that. Um, I've used these in the past and I found that they they work pretty well. So, going to give a give our chance with these and. I'm predicting we get swerved a lot just because we don't have bait on and obviously like we can't. So I'm predicting that we're going to get swerved quite a bit by these fish, but uh, we're just set up on a big flat here in about 30, 35 feet. Don't really expect a whole lot to go down until, gosh, I don't know what, six o'clock. I'd say 5.30. 5.30. So we're, we're here at 4.20 now. I'm going to take this little gulp minnow, it's tiny, put it on right through there so it's just going to hang like that i'm going to make sure it hangs horizontally if possible so down there it's going to hang something like that this sucker is going to glow this will be what they're most likely going to be interested in more than anything and uh, it's going to throw off some scent and vibrations and i'm using a spoon so we're on a, a bit of a flat here there there's a <coughs> Top to it, although it is still pretty flat. Um, typically, what I do for numbers is go a little bit deeper, down closer to the 40 foot range for more numbers, smaller fish, eater sized fish, smaller than eater sized fish. But when I'm targeting a big bite, when we're targeting a big bite, we are up on the very top. It's up at 30, I guess it's 34, 35 feet where we are right now. So we're right up on the top of the structure. That's where the biggest, most aggressive fish is going to come to eat um, at that witching hour time period, the last hour of the day. Um, and then it's also the reason why I wanted to fish this is it's a lot more flat. It looks like it's got more of like a sandy, muddy bottom. So even after dark, we have a good chance of a lot of burbot coming up here as well. So but yeah, 
probably see you guys in probably see you guys in about an hour when uh when the fish start to roll in he needs a break <laughs> yeah i need a nap <laughs> look at the size of that thing okay this is our big bad mama oh yeah are you speeding up yeah it's speeding up oh yeah so, oh something's gonna happen i feel like this is a walleye i feel like it's a really big walleye are oh there there's two, two? There's two. Something has to happen right now. Those are both big fish. Should we get like real aggressive or what? I don't know what to do, man. I we've don't do screwed, this. We've screwed this up twice, man. That thing's just gone with the wind. Comes in. Banging sand. Looks at us. Banging sand. See you later. Like until this fish was on me, if there's a fish here, I'd have no idea. <laughs> I can I can't even really see me. Oh like just barely. This is insane. That's a fish. Hundred percent right on the bottom. It's coming up to me now. That's a big fish. Yep. Look at that thing. Oh baby. Get her on the bottom. Come on! Like not even anything. Yeah, you just know as we're playing. It's got a whole lake full of real minnows why would he touch us right oh my goodness oh my goodness oh come on little buddy no it left that side mm -hmm. that's a larger than bait bait fish yeah okay come on let's do this Montego. Oh yeah. No. <laughs> no. And swerved. <laughs> Maybe not. It's still there. Yeah. So that's promising. That looks so good for a second. It did. It, Eric. It's really not that interested in me. Oh. Okay, that was the closest one so far. It's not gone yet, though. No, and there's one to the right, too. Oh, my gosh. That was big. Oh, there's one oh, there's on a, the bottom, yeah. too. What's going on? There's so much. Okay. Yeah, that's going to go. Yep. Oh, what? <laughs> Come on. I probably shouldn't yell. Oh, it looks so revved up for a minute. <clears throat> You're gonna catch him. I don't know. I can't even really see myself because I just see you. Where are you? That's you. It's going to you. It's gonna smoke you. But then there's another one behind it. It's gonna. Eat. Yes, yeah. sir. It's not that big. But it's not that small. It's definitely a walleye. Do you need a hand? I think I'm okay. Okay, I will film you then. Is that the hole? Is that the hole? Oh yeah, the hole's bobbing. It's a beauty. Oh, it's a beauty. It's not like a giant, but it's a nice one. That's exactly what we're here for. It's like a pretty good one. Yeah. I just don't want to get a hook on my... I guess it's not barbed. It's barbless. It's not barbed. It ate it. That's a nice fish. That's a good one. Crush that thing. Comes out super easy. Barbless, one treble. Barbless. Okay, so again, I don't have a measuring apparatus. Well, that is a super, super chunky fish. It's oh, like, yeah. It's really sprawled out. I don't know, I'd say that's like a 21, 22 incher. I'd give you 23, 24. That's exactly what we're here for. Actually, no, it's not. We're here for like a 28 incher. We'll, so, we'll see here. Yeah, we're going to put this one back and uh, 
get back down there. Measuring apparatus. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Just keep on measuring. Stick with me. <laughs> Ever. We can end on that. I can't believe you really thought there was a 21 inch walleye. Are you serious? I don't. I haven't seen a big walleye in a long time, dude. That well, it was like a good walleye, cause like the twenty one that or the twenty one and a half that I caught in the dirty stuff, that thing dwarfed it. <laughs> really? And I measured it. Yeah. Okay. It was a skinnier twenty one and a half, but you know, that was a healthy, healthy gal. It was so fat. Yeah, so fat. Instead of us just coming out and catching a twelve inch fish every time. Yeah, but like. 15 12 inch fish yeah you know yeah and that wasn't even as big as a mark as some of the, as some of the fish have, that have come in were no at least a bit though yes i think we'll still get a couple more before the night's over because we still have half an hour before it's dark you should have seen how far that thing had it down its face you know when you set the hook into like a real big one yeah and you don't move like it doesn't move and you're just like yeah oh boy yeah, I want that. Bro, you reeled right away from him. That's fine. There's a massive, massive suspended one. You catch that one. Okay. I got this guy. You got that guy. Okay, come on. You're, you're going to get double teamed, man. This is crazy. There's two of them. Yeah, that one on the left is huge. Why, does, why do neither of them want this snow, though? Because they see me. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> What's happening? We're both gonna get crushed. Yeah, you get that guy. You get him. I'm that trying. one's yours. I'm trying. That thing is so big, dude. Dude, it's not taking it though. Oh, it's so big. I don't know what to do. Yes! Woo! That's a big fish. Uh oh. Well, I wonder what we got. Dang it! That's not what I wanted. Okay, we'll see you in about 45 minutes, folks. All right, you keep doing that. I'm going to catch walleyes. Yep. Dang it, I thought it was... It could let's be a just, big walleye. I don't know. Let's just casually catch giant fish on 8-pound test. Dang it. Yeah, this isn't going to go very well. You're way over there. Oh, wow. Oh, well. Not going to be a long day now. You said seven? How does 9.30 sound? Yeah. It can't be that big, right? No, I think it's pretty big. Excuse me, sir. Come this way. Gosh, those are huge head shakes. You're really gonna make me like hero grab this thing myself? Yeah. You want? I'm gonna give you pliers too. Uh oh. What was that noise? Is it a pike? Oh, it's a pike. That's oh, okay. It's a pike. We're okay. What's with me and pike? <laughs> I'm tired of this. Hey, that's not bad. Pull them out of the water. We can play with that guy for a while. There we go. Crazy. I'm really happy that's not a lake trout. <laughs> nice. Well, see you later, buddy. Nice and happy. And he gone. Well, I call that a big fish. So that's kind of like... Big fish, yeah. Back on the big fish grind. That's what we're trying to do, right? Yeah. Charge this up. Show the camera how that glows. It's pretty freaky. Mm, it's glowing. It is a fish. Right underneath me. 
No, come to me. Oh, it's a big one. Yep. Come to me, come to me, come to me. Come to me, come to me. Come on. <clears throat> oh, yeah, here you go. Right, coming in. 100 miles an hour. Wow. Missed it. That's, that's a huge. That's not a walleye. That is not a walleye. Oh, just disappeared in the mud. This is. Come on. Such a good fish. Oh, two. There's only this rock. What life scope footage is this? That's insane. Oh, yeah. I feel like they're sharks. Yeah. Do you have that vibe too? They look like it. <laughs> I feel like we're trying to catch a shark. Holy. I mean, yeah. Big, big suspendo walleye maybe. The other one was pretty far off bottom. Didn't like what you were selling. No. It sure did not. I thought for sure we get bit there. Well, that was something. I definitely want to do this again. Yeah. But try harder. <laughs> <laughs> Charge the graph. <laughs> Charge the graph. Have like a camera. Catch more fish. Because that's like all I want to do now. I don't care about little fish. That's nice to have a fry every once in a while but yeah. yeah but like personally i don't really care <laughs> i've eaten enough fish in my day that's that's fun i like that oh, i'm tired and want to go home <laughs> <laughs> done we came and uh did what we set out to do we caught one really nice walleye and we caught a nice northern air caught it so we saw a lot of fish coming in in the hour and a half that we were here but we but we didn't really come prepared uh we set out to do this in like an hour and a half uh didn't bring a whole lot live scope was pretty much dead but this was super fun i really like doing this normally we're out on areas of the lake where you're going to catch more numbers of fish but they're all going to be you know 12 to 15 inches if it's a walleye you might luck into one that's over 20 inches but yeah like i said next time we're going to come a lot more prepared we're going to do it all day and uh, this was a lot of fun i really like chasing big fish around and, and trying to catch big bites so thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you at the next one